Oh, wait, quick question. Yep. What does a day in your life look like? And what does a day in your life look like? Okay, so for me, um, okay. What times you wake up? From from what you wake up to? You so I'm I'm I live like oh my I'm nocturnal. So we do our show at seven p.m. I'll typically wake up at oh, like maybe same as yeah seven p.m. Us, yeah, e- Eastern Standard Time, right? So um, I'll typically wake up like right before the show, like five p.m. or something like that. What? Yeah, dude. Yeah. So I'll, I'll take you through it, right? So I'll wake up at like five p.m. Damn. Uh, I'll prepare for the show, right? Depending on what the topic is. And then uh, I'll, I'll we'll do the show at seven. We'll be done by like eight thirty at the first show. Then I'll go to the gym. I'll go work out, and then I'll come up and we'll do the nighttime Your show. Gym with the every girls. day, four or five days a week. Okay. And then I'll go and then I'll come back upstairs, right? Because I'll go to the gym in my building. Then I'll come back upstairs and we'll film the show with the girls. Damn. Right. And then after we do that, we'll be done by like maybe one, two o'clock in the morning. Then uh, we go, we eat. And then what? Uh, after that, I'll get like work done. Whether it's preparing for the next show, I was working on my book for a while, so that took me quite a bit of time. Uh, recording the it link for Audible, to buy the book will be in the oh yeah, yeah. Why women deserve less, guys? It's live now. I, uh, Audible version coming very soon. Yeah. But I was working on that, uh, typing it up, and then also with um, doing the Audible version of it because I recorded it myself. Yeah, sick. Um, better. Um, yeah. I like I like Audible, especially the ones that the author does it himself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And and I like go like because I, I use a lot of my phrases and stuff in the book. But um, so I would do that or preparing for the next show or, you know, it basically or I'll because uh, I have another YouTube channel called Fed it where I break down criminal cases. It's like a true crime channel. Nice. Or I'll do research for that where I'll be like, OK, which case am I going to do next? Yeah. If it's like a serial so killer. So you grind basically. Yeah. It, it, yeah. So if it's like a serial killer or whatever, like I'll do like pretty extensive research. Nice. And I'll cover it on that channel. His whole background, upbringing, everything. Exactly. Yeah, so you. that I can do it so that when I come on and I do it live, it's like, OK, we or I, if I pre-record it, I'll be able to speak in an educated fashion and I put the time stamps in it too i'm real big on timestamps. so yeah. uh so then i'll do that until like seven eight nine ten in the morning work throughout the night and then go to sleep and then do it over wow. again seven to nine in the morning yeah Jeez. so yeah i'm like nocturnal so from nine to five p.m you sleep yeah like a reverse nine to five yeah it's a reverse nine to five because our show's at night so i basically wake up right before the show prepare do it gym second show eat and then work throughout the yeah, day. You know, I actually did this for a time when I was like, so during Ramadan, I was a kid, I used to, if there's any Muslims out there, they know. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You know, yeah. when you're fasting, you have to like break your fast at like 6 p.m. or 7 p.m., like sunset. Yeah. So we usually like stay awake and then like we'll sleep throughout the whole fast. So that yeah. we're, it's the sleeping, the sleeping time will put it's it in the fast. Cheating. It's kind of cheating. It is kind of. Low key, it is basically yeah. cheating. By the way, fasting, we should talk about later. Like fasting and productivity is like a massive. Yeah. Nowadays, finally, nowadays, the science has caught up to Islam. What yeah. we were saying, that now there's like, literally, it's like they talk about, uh, what's it called? Intermediate yeah, fasting. Intermediate fasting and, was, yeah. and we were like doing this sh- shit for ages. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know, yeah. uh, hundreds of years ago. Anyway, so we were talking about basically, um, what did you say? Yeah, that's my schedule, but that's the schedule. I'm nocturnal. Yeah. But do you think that, so I don't know, but I think the they say that the quality of sleep in daytime is, because I like the schedule. I would love yeah. to do this, but they say the daily, the, the schedule that you have mm-hmm. uh, and your quality of sleep is a lot lower during the daytime. Yeah. Have you noticed that? No, I mean, I'm okay because here's the thing. I'm used to it now because when I was working for the government, I used to work at night too. Ah, uh, so I would, like get, I would get called out late at night all the time, two, three in the morning. They'd catch That's when the crimes some, happen. The, some yeah. crook, yeah. So I, I was used to it even from since 2014. I've been, I've been that way. Mm. So. Yeah. So I'm heterosexual, so I go to the gym seven <laughs> days a week. I, I wake up at around 11 and then- Damn. Yeah, 10 or 11, and then have breakfast, do uh, a lot of creativity kit work that's been consuming a lot of my time recently, a lot of professors to handle, get in the, talk to the people, add a video for that, and then make sure everything's running there. Uh, There's been a lot of like behind the scenes business stuff that I've been doing. And then I I stream at 8 p.m. every single day, rumble.com slash Nico, every day. Check it out, link in bio. Yeah. And that's that's a lot of times, like three to five hours every single night. I go on Fresh and Fit probably like once a week. At this point, for the past oh, nice. couple right months, down the street from us. yeah, like oh, we're all in Miami, really? we're all in Brickell, the oh, same okay. neighborhood. So I've probably been going like once, once a week. So like that, that, 